If I take this exact video, I drop it into Opus Clip, then I get over 20 videos in just one click. And the best thing is, this works in any niche. It doesn't matter if this gaming, podcast or sports, you can do this with every video that you encounter. Now, I've done this myself actually, and I created this channel that got me over 200k views in a little of 28 days. And I'm just getting started with it. So you can actually do that too. I would advise you to do it with your own content though. But if you want to have a clip channel, then this is the tool that you need to use. Now, here's what I'm gonna show you in this video. First, I will show you how you can generate clips from your long form content. And then I will show you exactly how you can apply some editing tricks to make your videos more engaging. Starting off with Ops Clip. What we do is we go to our video that we want to use for short, then we copy it. Then we go to Opus Clip and then we just drop it in there. Now it asks you a few questions and here's what I would suggest you do for this. First of all, we're gonna use the Clip Anything feature for this. Then we're gonna select that this is an interview and it's also entertainment. Next up, we can apply a prompt into this. For this, I wanted to find the best viral moments. So I'm just gonna type in best viral moments. And most importantly, I want the length to be anywhere from like 30 seconds to like 30 to 59 seconds because it is a YouTube short. Now, next up, we can select our template. I'm gonna go for an easy one, which is karaoke. And now we just click on get clips in one click and boom, we got our video done just like that. So out of an eight minute video, we got around 16 clips, which is really good for like an eight minute video. Now let's start off with our first clip and we're actually gonna edit it. So the first clip looks like this. Song lyric of Harry Styles. Alexa play Love of My Life by Harry Styles. Correct. Yes, slay Millie. Oh. <laughs> what are your top three Harry Styles songs? Oh, my top okay, three. Okay, so this is a very good clip already. Now, what we do next is I want to edit it even further. So what I can do, I can click on edit clip. Now we're in the editor. Here we can do a couple of things. First of all, if we take a look at the text-based editor right here, you can see that if you click on a word, you can remove it. Or if you want to add in a section, you can add in a section right there. If we want to use it by the transcript, then we can do it like this. So sometimes the cut might not be perfect, but you can change it right here. But I really like this cut, so I'm not gonna change anything. The next up that I'm gonna do to enhance our video is I'm gonna change up the layout. So what you could do is you can do fill and then it will be just the character that you have in mind. If you don't like it, then you double tap it and then you can select the correct framing for this. But for this clip, I'm gonna leave it at fit because I want to have the image on there. Now, next up, we're gonna go through our video. For this part, I want her to be on full screen. So here, I'm just gonna go into the layout, I'm gonna click on fill, and I'm gonna drag her into the middle. What are your top three Harry Styles songs? Oh, my top three Harry Styles songs. So yeah, that's pretty much how you can change your clip in terms of the layout and in terms of changing up the video. Now to further enhance our video, I want to add in a voiceover because I want to make this video a bit more unique, add my own twist on it, if I like to say. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna type in voiceover. So I'm gonna do a voiceover of Millie Bobby Brown is a fangirl of Harry Styles. Then we can select our favorite speaker. The thing always happens. So I like this Brian voice a lot. And now we can generate the speech. So here we have a voiceover. I'm gonna drag it all the way to the intro. And now let's take a look at it. Billy Bobby Brown is a Harry Styles fan girl. Love of my life by Harry Styles. Correct. Yeah. So I wanted to have a bit more video in front of this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add in a section here. Then I'm going to say let's add in like this part. So I'm click add, and now that part will be generated. Billy Bobby Brown is a Harry Styles fan In June 2022. But what did you caption it? It was a song lyric of Harry Styles. So yeah, that's too long. So I'm going to adjust it to make it fit exactly part that I want to use. So I'm going to split it and now I'm going to delete this part. And now, as you can see, we have a part like this. Millie Bobby Brown is a Harry Styles fangirl. It was a song lyric of Harry Styles. Alexa! Then to make it even funnier and to remove that bar that we have here, I'm just going to crop it. Going to just focus on her face completely. Millie Bobby Brown is a Harry Styles fangirl. It was a song lyric of Harry Styles. Alexa, play! Love of lyric of Harry Styles. Alexa play Love of My So now our video looks like this. 
Millie Bobby Brown is a Harry Styles fangirl. Alexa Play, Love of My Life by Harry Styles. Correct. Yes, slay Millie. Oh. Here I see the text is messing up. So what I'm going to do actually is I'm going to drag it up there. You can see we have a save board in here. So you can play around with that. Actually, for the entire video, I want to have the captions a bit more up there. So for each clip, I'm just going to select them. And now for this part, because she's screaming Alexa, I think that's funny. I'm going to exaggerate it by making it very big. And then here, this caption, I'm going to make smaller again. So I now fully edited our video in terms of like the captions, in terms of the layout, and also in terms of adding in a voiceover. Now, what you could also do if you wanted to, you could generate a text part like a heading, and then you can add in a heading like right here, where you say like, Millie Bobby Brown is a Harry Styles fangirl, something like that, um, which could be used as a thumbnail as well. I already like the way it looks, so I'm just not gonna do that. Um, but yeah, what I, also want to do is I want to change the captions and I want to change the amplified word color to something that's a bit more yellow. So now I'm gonna copy this code here and then I'm gonna scroll down and I'm gonna go here and here I'm gonna change it also to yellow, make this the same yellow and now all of our highlights are the same type of yellow. So if you're happy with your clip, you click on save changes and now you have one clip completed. You don't have to do this for all of your clips, but if you want to have the best quality clips, then you might want to do it. I actually uploaded one of these clips that I made through Opus on our video and I got like a one out of 10 in the first one hour. So that is pretty good. So you can get good results with Opus by using this as an AI video generator. Now, if you like this video, then make sure to subscribe and comment down below what you want to see next. And click the video that's on the screen right now if you want to see more videos like this.